Tracy has a look at what's going around here in Central Ohio. And of course, we have been reporting how the flu is working its way through homes, schools, and offices. A respiratory infection that can be a direct result of the flu is what's going around this week. Upper respiratory infections, bronchitis, cold, sinus infections have people heading to their doctor's offices or the closest urgent care. Dr. Trevor Schull, a family practice physician in the Ohio Health Urgent Care Network, told me that some patients are even complaining of flu-like symptoms like chills, high fever, and exhaustion. Normal colds can have some of those symptoms, a little bit to a less degree, can have you know, the nasal congestion, sore throat, um, cough. Bronchitis will be more of a profound cough that can last two to, to three weeks, and pneumonia can have some of those same symptoms too. Upper respiratory infections, colds are self-treatable, so that means you're going to need Tylenol, ibuprofen, rest. I'm going to say it again, rest, drink plenty of fluids. This is what the medical experts are saying. They also say that your body has to fight off the illness. Now, there are some of these things that are difficult to diagnose. In fact, I heard from somebody on Twitter who said their flu was misdiagnosed. In fact, they had mono. So tonight on 10 TV News starting at 530, we're going to talk about how all of these symptoms are challenging and making Ooh. things difficult for doctors to diagnose. That's what's going on what's going around tonight on 10 TV News starting at 5.30. And for patients out there, and I'm going to raise my hand, I mean, you think you can fight it off for days and days and days and days, and at some point, you just got to go get the expert help, right? You do, and you have to keep using the sanitizer. I am, I am. Get your rest.